When someone mentions pigeons, most of us think of the bird that sits on power lines, bridges, and the barn roof. But these same birds with thousands of years of selective breeding and training have become the racehorses of the sky. They're just very good athletes. There are not very many animals can handle 14, 13, 10 hours non-stop of flying covering 500 miles. When pigeons are 30 days old, they go outside and look at the sun and look around and they kind of GPS the coordinates in their head and from that point to their best ability to try to go back home. They just, they just love their home. I guess that's what they call them, homing pigeons. Where I grew up in Czechoslovakia, the parents want to get kids into flying homing pigeons and taking care of them. So I think the kids need to be connected with the nature and they just need to have the animals, dogs, cats. They, if they're not connected with that, I don't think they'll be, they'll be close to nature and appreciate where the food comes from and how the whole cycle of life is um, it's spinning. This is one of the hobbies where you cannot rush. If you go, go, you lose a whole year, you got a new baby, you have to start over again. So it's a patient sport. When you spend a little time around these birds, it's easy to see how you could get hooked on the hobby and the sport of racing pigeons. This is Mike Gurnett, out among Montana's Fish, Wildlife and Parks.